That's one of the biggest ones. And like I said, it is a minimum of two year sentence in prison. Wooten changed lawyers after a week or so, which we uh, also covered. But not before his old ones had sent letters to all the major news organizations misrepresenting our work and muttering about injunctive relief. To be fair to other news organizations, they don't have Tom and Dan and three years of research to back their stories up. And newspapers tend to ignore other newspapers' exclusives unless they're forced by public outrage to cover them. Again, there's so much public outrage about this, why isn't anyone else covering it? But more than anything, this reminds me of the Whittingdale story in 2016, which in many ways was the 